Hello everyone, this is Dan Gramza and welcome to Gramza Market Studies for Wednesday, July 6th. I was looking for follow through to the upside, but as we talked about in the advanced video, when you see this loss of momentum, you have to be careful. In a commodity, you would really would expect a transition. However, the light volume yesterday, I thought could be a launch pad for further movement to the upside. Some comments that came out of Bank of England kind of set the tone for the market and we're seeing some downward pressure. Would not be surprised to see this move lower further, but I think how it finishes is going to be important for us for the next few days. I don't look for a big move down, but when it comes to the euro, we're also seeing that market weakening and I do look for further movement to the downside today in that market. But let's move on to the interest rates. A short the I should say the ten year interest rates. I went right back up as the stock market came down. I think that makes sense. Would not be surprised to see new highs, but we're looking for shadows on the highs for that market. In the gold market, it doesn't have a lot of reasons to move higher. However, right now with the uncertainty swirling out there, that is what we're seeing right now. This is Asia. And I am looking for follow through today in that market. So I'm looking for a strong day up in the gold market. Well, crude oil, with everything else going on, the dollar, the comments that were out there, we're seeing commodities softening a bit. And this behavior uh, is not unusual. However, do I look for a dramatic move down in today's action? I do not. Lower prices, but a bouncy bottom is what I'm looking for in crude oil. In beans, I'm looking for continued weakness. Uh, this market is approaching a level that we should see a bounce, but we're just not quite there yet. Well, that concludes today's market studies. Thank you for being with me, and I'm looking forward to being with you again tomorrow. In the meantime, take care.